became aware of the gun violence when I was 12. I was playing basketball and two gentlemen started shooting at a young man coming towards us out in the playground. Well, it should affect everyone uh, very deeply because 90% uh, of us are losing our youth and our youth are our future. So we should be trying to be out here and, and working with the kids and hopefully helping our future get through this. I lost my son uh, April 1st of 2006 to gun violence. Uh, his name was Willie Winston III. He was a Jesse White Tomlin. He had just signed a letter in 10th to go to Arizona State. Uh, it affected me very deeply and I became an activist in the city of Chicago to help find the person that killed my son. And we did. Not enough, not enough help from uh, the community. We need more help. Uh, we need more people to come out and work with the children in the city of Chicago. It, it has to start at home first, then it starts uh, with the community, then it starts with the, uh, I say, with the politicians, because the politicians can do a little bit more than the community. So it starts there. Home, politicians, community. I think that'll make a big difference. I don't want anyone to go through anything that I've been through. Losing a child is unbelievable. It's uh, a day-to-day -day process. Every day you have to try to focus. Even when you have other kids, it's, uh, you have to focus on making sure that you don't go crazy because when you lose a child, it's like you don't want to be here anymore. But reality sets in and says, hey, you got to get out and help someone or help your children make it through this. And hopefully nothing else happens to any of your kids. Put it down. Think before you act.